Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I have a really beautifully stunning book called Birdtopia by Daisy Fletcher. This is a really big book. It's nice cardstock, heavy quality. It is um it is 12 and a quarter by 9 and a quarter. It's by um like this at Deva. Daisy, oops, by Daisy Fletcher, Lawrence King Publishing. The this book has fifty eight illustrations, and the paper is vanilla cream, and some of them are colored in, um, by the artist. Okay, let's get flipping. I love how um she composes some of these, like she will make some of the birds are really big and the plants are really tiny or she'll make the plants super huge where they look like trees and the animals look teeny tiny it's really pretty i love how the back is this yellow cream color these hummingbirds are so pretty they do go into the spine they are double-sided non-perforated nice um heavyweight paper just really cute all the little the little birds see what I mean by like a tall leaf like that looks like a tree with the little birds on them and then we got a random fox here this is so cute just beautiful I love this page. I think all the little flowers and everything would be really pretty watercolor. This is the one that I started. I use fabric has steel art grip aquarelle color watercolor pencil and for the spots I used um the white signio pen. I need to finish the rose part. But I love how it's coming out. I love this two page spread of the peacock. And what's great about the book also, if you flip to the back, it'll tell you every single page and it'll show you every single page and it tells you what type of birds they are. So you can go and check them out. Like, the one I did, I'm not sure where it's at, this one, the one I did, I learned that it was a European goldfinch and a strawberry goldfinch, so I went and looked them up, and I kind of colored them the colors that I saw, and I'm really excited how it turned out. Like, she's got randomly colored in spots, like the fox here in this page but then there's also some black and white in the picture so you can go and color it yourself if you wanted to look at this hummingbird it's just stunning how she colored that in beautiful inspirational i love it these were all colored in already so you get them like this the vine is black and white so you could go and call it that if you wanted to some of the buds this was already colored in the only thing that i colored so far is those two birds i showed you so everything else is colored in this is my like my favorite bird <laughs> i love this big bird on this little bitty plants it's just really cute I like this page. I don't know what it is about it, the composition, I don't know. I just love this. I can't wait to color it.
woodpecker. This is going to be so pretty when I color pair in. I know you bird lovers will love this book. You could do anything on here. Uh, maybe, mm, maybe not um, your alcohol markers because it is double sided. But I watercolored it and I didn't have any problems with broccoline, bleed through, nothing. Got some hibiscus here. It's got beautiful flowers as well. Isn't that flower really gorgeous? And here we go with a table of con contents to show you what all the birds are. And then you got the back flap. It's just a really, really beautiful, high quality book. Um, uh, really beautiful Birdtopia by Daisy Fletcher. Go check it out. You will love it. I'm telling you guys, it is a gorgeous book. Thanks for watching. And if you haven't, hit that sub button and give me a thumbs up if you like the video. I really appreciate it. Thanks a lot, guys. Bye bye.